Ask yourself, where are you in two minds when it comes to Jesus? Let's say that you decide to evaluate Jesus. You look into his history, what he said about himself, and you decide that he's not a lunatic, not a liar, and certainly more than a good man. Perhaps you're finally ready to accept Jesus for who he is, who he said he always was, God himself. Now, if that's where you're at, then choose to go all in. Make the choice to move from unbelief to believe. Stop living in two minds. Doubt is good and healthy, but don't live there. If you have found that Jesus is in fact God, then move forward with faith and obedience in the life that He wants you to live. You know, we actually have an opportunity to be immediately obedient to God with our upcoming baptism celebration. You see, throughout the Bible, whenever someone decided to stop living in two minds and believe in Jesus, they were immediately baptized. The reason was clear. Baptism is a powerful symbol of a change that has taken place in your heart. It is saying to Jesus, I accept who you are, and I'm not ashamed to make that public declaration of faith. It's like Thomas responding, My Lord, my God, after seeing the holes in Jesus' hands. Or maybe you already crossed the line of faith months ago, but you've been living in two minds about getting baptized. Either way, this is your chance to step up and dive deeper into a relationship with Jesus. If you have any questions about baptism or how to get registered, feel free to visit our website or app to get all the answers that you need. But if this is an area of your life that he's calling you to let him lead, what are you waiting for? I hope that you prayfully consider this today.